Wow, what is going on YouTube? It has been like three months since the last city update. Not a whole lot has changed. You see that building right there? That's someone's mock I bought. And it's along with this castle I bought, I added the dragon. No big deal. Anyway, I'm going to do a separate video on those and a whole other video coming soon. So, where have I been? It's been summer. I've been actually selling off a lot of Lego I don't need anymore, so I can focus on hopefully building because I'm overwhelmed with space. Why not? Because that's what I did. I got a lot of stuff. got to sell a lot of stuff. Don't need it all. Do you need it all? Probably not. Think about it. Anyway, the park. The park has been expanded to the three base plates I originally had on, three 32 by 32 base plates. I just had the two kind of hidden behind the other buildings to my left off camera here, but the park is back, and I like it because it adds greenery. It's nice to have green mixed in with all the grays, add some color, some pop, some flowers, the fountain of fire. What else could you ask for? The Cool Guys Car Club is starting back up. If you know, you know. I don't know. You know. Anyway, this angle of the park, like the head-on view right here, editing in now, shows the cafe, or not the cafe corner, the Parisian restaurant, like, split with the park, and I don't like that. It's driving me absolutely crazy. I don't like it. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do something about it, let me tell you. Let me tell you, I'm going to go look for a 16 by 32 half of a modular building, and I'm going to throw that in there and see how that looks. I can center the Palace Cinema, or a ah, prison restaurant. I'm all over the place. It's been a while. Anyway, these little arcade machines I got out of someone's collection as well kept them they're pretty cool but here's what i'm looking for like half of the market street not the faded green grocer back there the bookstore i haven't converted to mills yet the other half of the bookstore i haven't converted to mills yet all right don't do one half but yes market street half of that ready for mills ready to go let's plug it in and it doesn't look good because look at the flower pot look at the walkway it's all crowded too busy i don't like it doesn't fit in that spot so, I don't like it. What am I going to do about it? Nothing. I'm going to quit YouTube later. Just kidding. We are going to actually throw in the pet shop half because, you know, every high-end restaurant has a pet shop right next door because zoning. Why not? Anyway, that looks much better, much cleaner. I like the path. Until you get to the end here, which I never noticed how crowded the end is there on the Parisian restaurant. Like, you can't walk by that. Look at you slap a building on there. Look at that. Look at this. This is like a... This is like a liability, a lawsuit waiting to happen. Someone's going to trip over a flower pot and fall on the bench, break your wrist. I don't know. So it doesn't look good. Train yard, cargo yard, all about the yard. Now we have this cargo crane here. This is from a set. I don't know the number. I forgot what it was. I took two of them and combined them into one kind of longer one here. Now I have a cargo crane, and it's kind of okay. It does, like, pop up if you move it too fast. I think it's just because, again, my tables aren't the most level, so there's, like, a lip maybe or it just kind of sucks i don't know but i do have to fix it because it is overhanging a little bit there and that's my own fault the way i spaced it out but that's a, a simple fix guys it's lego anything is fixable mostly kind of all the time not really most of the time look at that it's fixed i didn't lose any cargo crane space that just the wheels came in by one shifted on the top there and now you can glide across easily and grab your contraband from playing starfield and throw it onto that mare ship right there and not get any scans and free star colonies right if you know, you know. Anyway, I have these sound barriers I made a while ago when I had them on the train yard alongside the stadium there. I think they would look good if I just do some modifications, throw them in there, respace some of the stuff. So maybe add another, you know, set of masonry bricks, taller, obviously wider, move that yellow support crane down one and make them fit nice and even, e evenly. Nice and evenly. I'm trying to do these YouTube videos in one one breath, one take, and so I don't spend too much time editing. So. We're doing it live, kind of. Not really. I filmed this silently. Now I'm just talking over it, talking to you. But I appreciate it. And now if you're here, hit the like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think, you know? It really helps this channel out because I don't help it out that much because I kind of just abandoned it. But anyway, there's the walls. They look good. I have roads to throw down too because I have a stack of roads I built a while ago. Oh, look, there's a stack of roads. Here they are. Wow, looks a lot better. Coming to life, guys. It's coming to life slowly. Everything takes time. I don't have a lot of time to do this anymore like I used to. I work and all that stuff. Anyway, that's life. Everybody works. Everybody's got things. Just, you know, use your time wisely and what brings you joy and happiness. I sold a lot of stuff. Now I have more room for happiness in my life. Anyway, there's this. I did do that. I had the older windows, I guess, that don't have, like, the, the proper footing. So I had to use these two by twos there to kind of hold them in place on top i think it looks okay you can't really tell from too far away um but it's gonna be what it's gonna be i moved the grand emporium over there you see that that's from the baseball stadium right there that walkway and now it's gonna be over here on my train platform i think i think that's gonna look really cool 
So I'm going to do like a couple of those platforms for the train station. Get that out of the way. That's going to have its own video soon. That is really sick. It has full interiors. Again, I bought that from somebody. I did not build it. The train platform I did build. And I'm going to put one there and another one there. And I think we're going to do that curve station like I always wanted to do. So I'm going to get working on that. Actually, I'm going to do a lot of videos this month. But I say a lot, at least a couple. One on the castle, one on this black I don't know what to call it, blacksmith, not blacksmith, little medieval market. There's a green, uh, the Grand Emporium I moved, like I said I did, see, I'm not a liar, just not, uh, not always accurate sometimes. Anyway, the park looks pretty decent over there, I think, that's from earlier in the video, shout out to earlier in the video, and shout out to you for watching all the way here to the end. So that's what I have for right now, let me know what you think down below, I greatly appreciate it, that castle is sick, I added the dragon, no big deal, yet again, and uh, yeah, thanks for watching, as always, bye now.